If you work at home and don't take a home office deduction, you could be flushing money down the tax toilet. If you're self-employed, a home office deduction could save you hundreds on your taxes because you can deduct things like your mortgage interest and your utilities. But there are very specific rules. Here's what you really need to know. P and E. Now the P stands for principal or primary place of business. The E stands for exclusive, meaning it's used exclusively for business. A double duty space like your living room or your dining room table, that doesn't qualify. Now here's a common question. What if you're an employee, but you sometimes work at home or occasionally telecommute? Well, the answer here is no, you can't deduct that home office. You used to be able to, but under the new tax law, no dice. If you do qualify though, here's a simple way to compute your deduction. Five bucks a square foot times the number of square feet you use for business, 300 square feet max. Bottom line, if you're self-employed, final schedule C, meet the criteria, and this deduction is still gonna be available to you. Want more info? Well, just go to moneytalksnews.com and do a search for Tax Hacks 2019. For Money Talks News, I'm Stacy Johnson.